This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 31, verse 5. As birds flying, so will Yahweh of hosts defend Jerusalem. Defending also, he will deliver it, and passing over, he will preserve it. Call Halal, Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Rakakwadash. That's giving all praise to the Most High in the name of His only begotten Son. In the name of the Holy Spirit, my name is Abar from the Prophets in Babylon, camp down here in Tampa, Florida. And I want to give double honors to the elders and apostles, the great minister who taught us his truth and who rule well. Peace and salutations to the hopeful like scattered abroad. All right, I just happened to be scrolling through and I had um, found this story on TMZ on Snapchat. Okay, and it says UFO sighting pilot spots series of bright lights. And what these lights are is these lights are what they call UFOs. But according to the Bible, these are the chariots of the Most High God. Okay, these chariots um, were, you know, our salvation, man. These chariots led us out of the wilderness. Okay. And you read about the chariots over and over again in the scriptures. We're going to grab a couple of scriptures on it. But I thought the, the story, as, as, as we're going to go to read, was very interesting. So before we get into it, let me bring this back. This is the book of Isaiah, chapter 5, verse, I'm so lucky, Isaiah, chapter 31, verse 5. As birds flying, so will Yahweh of hosts, mean Yahweh of armies, because the Most High have many armies, man. Okay, he has um, his men. Okay, that's going to be made um, a part of the army. Okay, he has um, the angels. He has these chariots. Okay, he has those missiles. Okay, and, and, and all these things are going to co um, come together. To, 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 to have their part in destroying this infrastructure of this kingdom as, as we see it, as we know it. Okay. It says, defend Jerusalem. And Jerusalem is a people before it's a place, man. Okay. He's not going to go and defend the land. He's going to defend his people. Okay. Which are the children of Israel. Okay. Which is going to go for, for further on to, to us say. It says, defending also, he will deliver it. And passing over, he will preserve it. So the Lord is going to preserve Israel, man. And this great this death and destruction is coming upon this place. He said, pass, he says, defending, defending, also he will deliver it. Who, who? The elect, Israel. Okay, Jerusalem, which is a people before us a place. It says, and passing over, he will preserve it. So what? Passing over what? Um, you know, like I how you have the Passover, how when uh the um Egypt the ancient Egypt was destroyed. The Lord told the Israelites to go into, in, in, into their dwellings and uh, put blood, po bl blood on the post of their doors. And he was going to pass over their houses and not cause destruction to come to their houses. Well, that's the same thing the Lord is about to do in, in these end times as he bring those, those plagues that came to e Egypt and even more plagues. And that final plague being thermonuclear destruction to America, man. Okay. And in the midst of that thermonuclear destruction, you're going to have these ships, you know, going at Esau, man. It says, turn ye unto him from whom the children of Israel have deeply revolted. You see, so it's all about the children of Israel, man. But let's go ahead and go into the story. It's pretty interesting. It says a pilot was joined by more than just another commercial. So like a pilot was joined by more than just another commercial commercial airline flights over the pacific ocean during a recent trip recording what he believes was an entire fleet of ufos so you see there's they're seeing these ships more and more man okay and, and oftentimes they see them in fleets you know and you see how they're moving that's why the scripture said before say as birds flyeth you know they're in a formation this is not just you know, some lights in the sky, man. Okay, this is the holy heavens. And the scripture said that the Lord was going to bring um, his kingdom on earth as it is in heaven. Okay, and this is what you see in the beginning stages of, man. Okay, because what? This place is about to be in dire straits, man. Okay, great judgment. And hell is coming to this place. And if you ain't on the most high's good side, you are not going to be delivered out of here, man. It says, uh, Psalm chapter 68, verse 17, the chariots of Yahweh Bashim Yahushai are 20,000, even thousands of angels. So in, in, in these ships are the angels, man, the holy angels, man. Okay. The Lord is among them. So when, when the Lord does come, okay, and crack that sky, he's going to come in these ships. Okay. He's going to come in these vehicles. He's going to have the angels with him. Okay. 
the hey, the, 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 when we when you see all these ships in the sky and you see that huge ship, that's the Lord is that's going to be among them as in Sinai in the holy place. And you read about, you know, how, you know, di, 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 like I said, different accounts in the Bible where the Lord came down and spoke to the Israelites and, and, and he, he or he came down in a chariot. OK, even our Lord, whenever he was risen up, you know, after, uh, you know, after he had got crucified, hey, man. He, 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 he dwelled with disciples, the disciples who later became apostles for a little bit. And then he got beamed up into a chariot, man. Okay. It says, um, let's go. Let's, let's get some more of this. Hey, look at that, man. That's strange, man. He had to zoom all the way in. That just go to show you what's happening above us, man. Okay, no matter what's going on in this earth, the Lord got some greater things in store for his people, man. All right, it says the video believed to have been recorded in the last few weeks shows between nine and sometimes up to 12 of the bright objects. So like you, you can see some light up and dim at random periods, but their pace, their pacing and speed seem to remain constant. It's like a consistent. So there you go. You know, that shows you that this is not just. Lights in the sky, man. This is an is is an, 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 an very intelligent force. Okay, this is the most highest holy angels, man. Okay, the God of Israel. Okay, and, and pretty soon they're about to make their um their um you know debut, man. Okay, they're about to create hey, amen. It's about to be if, if you don't know, watch the movie. You can watch the movie Independence Day with Will Smith and watch the movie War of the Worlds with Tom Cruise and you put them two together. Okay. You go j j just do that. And from there, you're going to know exactly. OK. So lucky for that. It says, according to reports, the pilot was flying at about uh, thirty nine thousand feet and can hear. It's lucky you can hear him say that is some weird shit. You see, that is something flying as the lights continue to glow and move. So he was he, he was blown, man. You know, he, he was, you know, um, you know, thrown off guard, man. He said, that's some weird shit. You know, so that's something you don't see every day, man. You know, but these people, you know, this is all going to lead up to something, which is going to be the day of judgment. OK. It says, uh, Isaiah chapter 66, verse 15, for behold, Yahweh will come with fire and with his chariots like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire. So the Lord has a very, the Lord's going to be angry when he comes, man. He ain't coming with hugs and kisses and rapture everybody up. You know, all you got to do is, is say you believe and he going to rap. No, that, that's, that's bullshit, man. The Lord is coming to bring great death and destruction to this place, man. Hey, I was um, I've been trying to get 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 the clip, but I haven't been able to get it. Um, but the other night, last night, it was a woman on 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 the same Snapchat app who live in the area. I never actually, you know, I don't really know her. I just had her on her or whatever, and she was at a um event, you know, um, pretty much downtown where we used to teach at, and it was a damn Christmas uh per uh, 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 uh I think I believe it was like a Christmas play or something. And um and this Christmas play they had you know um transgenders man okay grown ass transgenders in female clothes and you know pantyhose and whatnot dancing in front of children okay you know you had adults there too but you had children in the front and it was dancing in front of the children man okay and I, I said this is some sick shit and you know she you know try try to play yeah yeah I hit it but I said well, well don't nah you, yo ass there you see. So that just go to show you that this place is a desperately wicked man, and these people don't have no idea what's going on. So when 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 whenever this this destruction does come, okay, a lot of these people are going to get caught up in it. Okay, you are going to be, um, you know, a victim of the indignation of Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai for your own wickedness, man. Okay, your own disbelief. You see, because when we heard this word, we had to make changes in our life. These other people hear this word and they put it to the side and act like they ain't, they ain't hear it, man. Okay. And there's going to be a recompense for, 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 for that. And this is the beginning of that, man. It says, um, 
The published sighting comes on the heels of the Department of Defense announcing the launch of a UFO task force. The new government initiative has been hit with plenty of criticism from skeptics who believe the move is simply the Pentagon wanting to control and hide reported sightings. And recently, the Pentagon came out with all these um, um, declassified, which were at one point classified um, documents. And in a lot of those documents, the majority of it was blacked out, man. All right. But they had like, you know, a, a couple hundred pages or whatever of them just going into these um, these vehicles, man. And, and, they, and they just created a new task force. OK, because they're trying to because what they, they know the Lord is coming, man. OK, the, the, um, the Vatican has one of the biggest, if not the biggest telescope in the world. OK, where it can see it's out of space and they can see those chariots coming, man. OK, you can see the Lord coming. OK, that's why he knows he had, he had but a short time. This is why you see this man moving with great wrath. This is why your rights have been taken away from you, man. I had somebody talk, I was talking to somebody the other day and it was like, yeah, but I don't, you know, I don't, I, I don't know. Like, you know, you know, maybe this is going to just blow over. It's going to have, it's, you know, this is, this thing says, you know, you, you know, you, you know how, how people is, man, you know, in that optimistic spirit. And I said, I imagine something, man. How much have things changed? I forgot exactly what she said, but I, I said, how much have things changed in the past year? Okay. Or in the past two years, drastically, man. Okay, so anything is possible, you see. And now they're coming out talking about, you know, that uh, Karagma and this, that, and the third. Okay, so 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 we know what all this leads up to, man. It says, um, Isaiah 66, verse 15. Um, also like, I'm going to go to um, Jeremiah 4, 13. Behold, he shall come as the as clouds. What do clouds do? They fly, you know, or, you know, pr pretty much there in the sky. You see how clouds come? They, they, you know, they pretty much, you know, um, climb over the sky above you. That's how these chariots are going to be, man. You know, they're going to hover o o over in the sky above you. And it's like here. And his chariot shall be as a whirlwind. And what is a whirlwind? You know, if you see like a, um, imagine like a tornado in the water. Okay. It's going it's, it's to stir everything up, man. Okay? And that's going to be America going down the drain. It says, His horses are swifter than eagles. Woe unto us, for we are spoiled. So those horses are talking about um, um, symbolic for those chariots, because horses mean power. And he said, they're swifter than eagles. So these vehicles are very fast. You see? 